we build the most capable motors in the world. 30 years of electronics development for renowned companies around the globe have taught us how to get it right. My name is Christian Stangl and I'm the head of the business unit EQ Drives. HPR stands for Harmonic Pin Ring and Harmonic Pin Ring is our unique um, gear technology we have at TQ. The specialty of the HPR system is that the gear system is concentric to the shaft of the bike. That's, that's one of our gears and um, that's the gear setup itself. And if you have a shaft of an e-bike or any bike, it's concentric to the shaft. And that makes it really unique because we can transmit the force around the shaft. In our case, we have multiple teeth interconnecting with each other. In a normal gear, you have just one or max two gear teeth that interconnect with each other. In our case, if you look at this gear setup, you have always at least half of them interconnecting with each other. And this allows us to transmit way more force than on a traditional planetary gear. Benefit um, the rider or the, the system has from it that um, we can build the gear setup smaller and way more quiet. I'd say that's one of our competitor systems and that's our motor. And if I put it on top of it, you can see the difference um, in size. That's, um, I'd say, a usual common e-bike motor. And here you see um, there's a little cogwheel and this turns very fast. This needs to transmit all the energy. If I turn it quite fast, you will recognize immediately um, a sound. If I, I'm doing the same on ours, there's almost nothing to hear. And that's one of the unique things we have. We have a high performance gear that is able to transmit a lot of power in a very small space. We can build it therefore quite small. Due to a lower transmission rate we need, our motor can turn with a lower rotational speed, which makes the system in total very quiet. It's not just the motor and the gear, it's also the motor electronics we see here. So that's our motor electronic and it's um, very small compared to one of their electronics, where it's almost the same stuff on it. We are way smaller. I think um, it was 2007 when we started the joint venture with the German Space Research Institute, it's called DLR. At this point of time, the DLR was searching for um, motors that would suit their demand for traveling to space. And there was no industrial motor available that would be suitable for flying into the space. So therefore, they created a very specific, very high torque density motor, which we industrialized together with them. And from, from this technology, we are still leveraging having the highest torque density on electrical machines on the market, which means at the same size, we can provide um, double power. The other way around, we can have half weight or half size at the same power. And that makes also the system smaller and more powerful than other e-bike systems. There's no single point um, that makes our system so special. It's all of the components. The benefit for the rider is different. For each person, for each rider, I couldn't just mention one benefit. One person likes the lightweight of the bike or how it feels if you go into a train. The other one likes um, the low noise it has. Others, they would say, wow, this bike looks like a normal bike or like an analog or bio bike. Everyone takes something different out of it. But in general, I feel it's a good package. Um, it's, it's light, it looks like a normal bike, it's a beautiful bike, very good in handling, and it just makes fun. People are usually um, comparing system on fact sheets, but at the end, it's not the number that's printed on the battery itself, it's what you get 
in reality out of the system. So do you really get the energy that's printed on the battery? We are in electronics since many, many years. And we focused on getting all the energy that's inside the battery, getting it out to be consumed by the rider and not staying inside the battery. That's our battery management system. And this makes sure every cell in this battery stays healthy. It's placed like this in the battery and it's interconnected with all the battery cells. It's always the whole system that counts. And it's not just the motor, it's not just the battery, it's the seamless interconnection of all of them. The minimalistic display that's concentrating on its functions and not on doing fancy other stuff. All together, including the software, makes the system so unique and so special. That allows us to have a way more natural ride feel. To describe the ride feel is difficult because after 10 seconds you forget that you are on an e-bike. You feel like the fittest day in your life. So you sit on a bike, you reach as high as the distance you can travel. The trips you do will be longer. We love what we do. And you see it in the mechanics, you see it in the electronics, and you also see it in the software. So why would you go for an HPR system if you want to be quiet, light, and have the most natural light feel on the market? and in addition have a very beautiful bike, um, you could go for the HPR system and you won't be disappointed. If I would have to explain it in my own words, if you want to be the pilot and not the passenger, the light mountain bike or the light e-bike system is the right system for you.